Hi, I'm Lisa Graham. I'm the music director of the Metropolitan Chorale. Welcome to my home. We're here today for the first time back together since March 2020, uh, seeing each other, singing some of the music we've been working on for this entire time, and really just delighting that it's summer and uh, we're sharing this moment together. I hope you enjoy this project. It's called Home. It's about the experience of home in, in a musical fashion, and the music is going to tell different stories. We have premieres by Stephen Samets, and we have some Dvorak, and we have some Brahms, and we have Stephen Paulus, all about home. And we hope that from our home to yours, that you'll enjoy this snapshot of our 2020, 2021 experience.
March 2020, we were actually set to perform a concert called World's Fair that Lisa had been working on. We were ready. We sounded great that Tuesday night. It was really, we had fun and the music was great. And then everything had to close down. And I think from going from that complete just running on adrenaline, trying to make a concert happen to just nothing, uh, that was a huge shift. And it was definitely kind of felt like whiplash. It was strange what happened to the world and, and in a small way then also to the choir and, and everything was all of a sudden had disappeared between our fingers.
this past year has been a challenge for every choir all over the world. We're not alone in that. We decided over the pandemic that we really needed to keep meeting as a chorus. You miss the connection and you try to find it other places, but nothing really matches the experience of being in a choir with other people. You know, it's not just about the music, it's about collectively producing something with other people who have the same passion that you do. And I think that's what I've missed most. It's just the experience of being together in pursuit of a common goal. The choir was not at all silent. We saw one another through Zoom almost every week, if not every week, and, and uh, the, the community grew, I think, stronger through it. I got to know people on a personal level as I did not before. And, and now I have friends whom I had seen for years just singing there, but there were then other choir members. Now I would call them friends. That's the positive side of this, this crisis that it brought us together on a personal level that we would otherwise, it would have taken more years for that to, to be accomplished. Being able to come to Lisa's house today and see all the people that I've missed for over a year now is, it's just magical. Everybody is smiling so wide. <laughs> We're all so happy to see each other and I just can't wait to sing with them again. Oh, it's fantastic. We're back. <laughs> this is the first official meeting of the uh, group as such in this garden. And, and I think we'll rehearse again come next fall and, and we'll be back on stage together. I can't wait. To be able to walk up here and see everybody here was just, I can't even really describe it. It was just kind of the sense of something finally clicking back into place. It's wonderful to be able to hug. Again, that's been my main goal is hugging. So to be able to just walk right up and start hugging has just been just filled my whole heart. I'm very excited. I 
I'm just looking forward to being on stage together with everyone, maybe with like a really big orchestra, do just do a really big choral work, maybe with a hundred plus voices, where hopefully we'll get back to normal. But I'm just looking forward to singing again in person. So We are so excited to uh, come to Lisa's place to, to see her smile, her hopes. I'm happy to, to be back to the choir. I don't go to church, but I go to rehearsal on Tuesday nights and I harmonize. And that's the most important thing because there is something that really grabs you when your voice joins with another voice and it becomes something more than either one separately. 
I think that the heart of many choral organizations, obviously is the music, but, but truly it's about the people. It's about the community, about the relationships, the connection, um, and music is that catalyst. And this project is very personal to us because of the text, because of our experience. So it, it really is kind of like a little time capsule. Home isn't necessarily a place, you know, it's, it's here, it's here, you know. So um, knowing that you have this group of people and this friendships and it, it, that feels like a home. Ooh.